Well, has your credit card information been compromised? Today, Target says the information breach is even worse than originally thought. Up to 70 million customers are at risk, nearly doubling its previous estimate of 40 million. And it's not just your credit or debit card information that's out there. And in your side, Simone de Rosario is live in the newsroom to explain. Simone. Well, that's right, Guy and Stella. New info from the investigation reveals thieves stole your personal information, too. Names, mailing addresses, phone numbers, emails, on top of, of course, your credit or debit card. If this happened to you, here's what you need to know. The number of people affected is alarming. More than one in every five Americans is walking around with their credit or debit card information and their personal information in the hands of thieves. Narrow it down to Americans old enough to have a debit or credit card, you're looking at roughly a third of that population. Target says we are truly sorry and that guests will have zero liability for the cost of any fraudulent charges. But that doesn't mean it's not a hassle. So what do you do if you've been hacked? In most cases, banks and credit unions say they will call you if they suspect any fraudulent charges on your account. But if you catch anything suspicious, call your bank immediately. Have your account information ready along with details of any suspicious charges. Your bank will review recent charges and, if necessary, cancel your card. You will never be responsible for those fraudulent charges, but claims could take up to 10 business days to process. Expect it to take that long to get your new card in the mail as well. While you wait, most banks say you can stop in for a temporary card. And in the days following any suspicious activity, it's not a bad idea to monitor your online statements closely, making sure no pending charges come through. Now, in light of this massive breach, Target plans to offer free credit monitoring and identity theft protection to all its customers for one year. The company will announce how to enroll in that program next week. Live in the newsroom, I'm Simone Del Rosario, KGA 9 on your side. Simone, thank you. It just sounds like a big, big mess. It's a sure pain does. living in the digital age, isn't it? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes.